Yo, what is up everybody? It is Shots. Welcome back to another video. Now, in today's video, I'm going to actually be talking about a massive problem that's been happening in Pixel Gun 3D. Now, this hasn't been happening just to myself. It also has been happening to a lot of friends of mine. And this is a big problem and something that you'd think Pixel Gun would have fixed a long time ago, considering how important it is and how much it can actually affect somebody's experience with this game in today's video i'm going to be talking about the situation with the bands that is actually happening because it's come to my attention after i have gotten banned myself temporarily for two weeks i think that the reporting system is basically flawed due to me so i i got banned myself and a few of them my friends have been getting banned like this is as of recently uh i've actually had a quite a few friends getting banned and pretty much when you message the devs or you message the support they're pretty unclear with why you got banned and it just makes no sense because you'd expect them to be clear with something like this especially with a game that's behind a massive paywall where you have to spend to compete in this game that's another problem in itself but when you put getting banned into the mix for something that you don't even know what you've done wrong is another problem in itself and this has been a problem that's been going on for a while now in PG and recently if you guys didn't know the developers actually added temporary bans so basically, temporary bans, they kind of act as a warning, I guess. If you do something that is against the terms of service, but uh, the devs obviously uh, don't care as much to give you a perma ban. It's basically one of those situations. The only issue that with this is, guys, like, for example, a lot of my friends and even myself don't know why we've gotten banned. Because we haven't done anything to warrant getting banned from this game temporarily even. We've always played fair and uh, we never abused any exploits. So I don't understand why Pixel Gun is actually banning legitimate players. And this should not... I shouldn't even have to be making this video in the first place, guys. Uh, if you didn't know, um, I just want to make things clear to everybody. So I actually did end up reason uh i did actually end up getting banned yesterday now the reason said was why i got banned was because i was quote unquote afk farming now if you guys don't know what afk farming is it's basically where you get a few kills in a match or you capture a point or you you know win the game and then you go afk now afk farming i don't know why this is even bannable now but apparently it is because yeah uh, i've gotten banned for it and a few of my friends have actually gotten banned for it too now uh, there's uh, many reasons why this shouldn't be bannable i mean you're not directly abusing any exploit so i just i can't see why it should even warn a temporary ban like not even a warning AFK farming is basically what I just mentioned where you get a kill and then you pretty much just uh, walk away or you do something else and you leave your device on, which I think it's pretty unfair that people are actually getting banned for that. And that's a whole entire topic that I have to talk about in another video. But another big reason why people are actually getting banned is due to people modding clan forts. This has been a problem for a long time now. And you think the devs would have done something about it. Now, as somebody who's experienced my clan for getting modded myself, it is out of your control, really. Because how are you supposed to know that the dude was a hacker and he had the intent of modding the fort if hackers can add wins and make their accounts look legitimate? Now, this is a whole other problem that I intend to touch on in another video because it has affected me and some other people but yeah guys let me know what you guys think about this reporting system because in my opinion it is massively flawed and 
I'll be really disappointed in this game if I do not end up getting unbanned earlier than my set unbanned date. Because it shouldn't be, it shouldn't have happened in the first place. It shouldn't have happened, guys. And this is another problem that a lot of people have been experiencing. I know it's not just me, so I just had to make this video because I feel like this warrants a whole video to be made about it. Because, you know, when people spend a lot of money on your game, uh, messing with their accounts is probably the last thing you should be doing. And, you know, at least clarifying why they've gotten banned instead of, giving vague answers to reason why they've been banned and uh yeah i could post up a lot of screenshots about me experiencing these things with pg but i just don't feel it's necessary uh, maybe i'll make another video if the situation gets any worse and i really hope that the developers fix their reporting system especially within this game because it is a massive paid wall game in some areas people have spent money on this game just to have gotten banned for reasons that do not warrant a ban but with that being said guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you guys really do support me uh join my discord because we talk about pixel gun and i made the new discord basically because yeah we're guarding pixel gun there and uh, you know we got an active community and people squad there all the time that being said peace